Welcome to this interview, Wall of Fame interview. Here with me, I have Piyush Savan. He is from Goa Engineering College, and I remember he joined uh, our mechanical design ma uh, mastery course, online course, and then he took admission for our six months course that is uh, postgraduate diploma in tool design. And one thing I understood that there are very few students who are taking action as per the plan we have. So Piyush is one student. who is very obedient and whatever i told him that you have to do this activity he 100% followed that and i remember he has completed gearbox housing model there are very few students they have completed such type of critical models and now he has started his journey as a design engineer in the industry so congratulations piyush how you are feeling right now so i am feeling uh, grateful sir thanks for all the appreciation and your guidance uh, all the time and uh, uh, any uh, situation any doubts you were always there to help us so, so tell us about you your journey thank you tell us about your journey how you when did you decide that i have to uh, start this journey as a design engineer tell us about your background your college and other activities also so the the my journey is quite inter interesting uh, it started during lockdown so way before lockdown to say uh, i was in my third year third year of my college and uh, i was doing some uh, modeling on uh, solidworks that okay. time that was the first time i started uh, um, working on cad so i realized that there something is missing in me uh, then i need to improve on that field so in fourth year we had a uh, subjects to choose so i opted for core design subjects right and thereafter also i uh, got interest in design so later during then lockdown ha happened and uh, our project was also stuck so there was no way we could practically ap means approach our project so we had to make it uh, completely online uh, and a report and all that stuff but i find a unique way of uh, doing my project that is i uh, reverse engineer my uh, means project and completely make made a model of that in solidworks completely on my own and that motivated me to uh, further uh, uh, enhance my knowledge and uh, get to know the software more miss uh, more uh, precisely right and uh, later when uh, that project got successful i got motivated and i started designing my uh, means referring youtube uh, google and everywhere internet and started making different models and uh, it uh, i utilized my lockdown that way and uh, one uh, that uh, that day means one day i uh, managed to uh, uh, interview uh, get interview in one company but uh, i got failed in that interview okay. and it was uh, for a design engineer uh, okay. role okay and so it uh, kind of demotivated me and then uh, it uh, it uh, kind of uh, gave message to me that i am kind of insufficient in design so that way i started working on my design skills later and uh, somehow i ended up in pune let's okay. see yeah. and how did you connect with uh, institute it tell us about that uh, story yeah so i i want to give thank to one of my friends who forwarded me a facebook post uh, of a uh, sir's uh, post uh, one day he just casually asked me to attend uh, sir's meeting uh, webinars yeah and uh, i attended his webinars and uh, i got really impressed that next day onwards i uh, joined his class on that uh, same day only i inquired about his offline classes also i uh, i was so much into this design field like i found a proper uh, teacher to guide me in this 
area so that nice. was how i have found it okay and how did you prepare to achieve this uh, tell us about that journey means when you started your uh, course so what were those uh, important uh, we can say steps you followed and uh, you achieved this i generally i started with some motivation sir i wanted to do something in design means uh, my my point was to start, start somewhere like uh, start with basics then uh, go step by step uh, you may get doubts or uh, any uh, uh, any obstru- obstructions then you uh, slowly clear them that's how uh, i happened to uh, increase my knowledge sir. nice nice and tell us something about uh, your interview question so that uh, the uh, new joinings that means those uh, student they want to start their journey they will also be get benefited out of this question so which were those questions you were asked during interview technical questions if you can remember i'll try to remember uh, the company which i interviewed i was interviewed in uh, first they mostly ask about uh, gdnt topics then uh, uh, something about welding symbols okay yeah uh, this were the questions i was unaware of earlier then as i uh, got into design completely then uh, uh, when i uh, uh, switched to, means when i uh, interview i got interview in another company i uh, I, i i was fully prepared that any question like i could uh, answer where well, well, let it be related to gdnt and uh, welding uh, symbols or fixtures usually but uh, the thing was i wasn't uh, asked any uh, questions in my latest company okay. but i was i was given a, a mod, model test okay. which was around a one hour test okay uh, and i had to make around uh, two or three models they basically tested my uh, approach towards making a model and how quick i am uh, making those models okay that strategy also they must have observed like uh, constraining part or uh, feature making that orientation that kind yes. of uh, things right okay so in one interview uh, there were uh, three models different models right right sir nice and after that model test what was there uh, that there, there was a technical interview separate or uh, uh, hr round or what was that means or they directly uh, uh, selected you uh, in that particular process so how was that there were actually no uh, further rounds they directly selected me after the uh, model test okay. so they actually ask about my educational background and uh, further uh, means uh, courses details that's okay. all okay that is the course details means what you learn in the course yes sir okay right. okay and tell us something about your day to day activities what uh, what are your roles and responsibilities in the company uh, how you are uh, managing the design activities Com- my role is to completely manage whatever I, uh, like kind of a manager as well as uh design. design engineer yeah okay okay so i have to assign tasks to uh, operators uh, okay. this this uh, particular job should be done by the end of the day uh, then uh, i uh, de- i design uh, certain models which were provided by clients uh, they i have to provide the, those igs files or step files to operators then um, uh, then i also worked on uh, reverse engineering projects sir okay so, so this igs and step uh, can you tell us something about that because some uh, mechanical engineers uh, they are starting from this particular point so tell us something what is that igs or step so igs basically refers to initial graphics exchange uh, it's a uh, it's a file format wherein you can uh, use uh, you can uh, open that model in any software uh, 
suppose i am providing this i just file to uh, a vmc operator he can uh, uh, use that uh, model to uh, uh, further uh, program the cam operations okay yes, yes. programming right yes then uh, i pro the step file uh, it, uh, it is required by usually my customers so they can view in their uh, softwares and uh, study the proceedings means how uh, on my end how i am designing the part and okay and uh, this uh, reverse engineering can you tell us something about that sure sir sure so reverse engineering basically there was there is one assembly uh, which was being used in production line so it has around 9 uh, to 10 parts so basically disassemble the part then uh, the parts which are critical uh, should be measured in uh, those dimensions should be measured during uh, cmm that is uh, comp- uh, cmm uh, dimensions can you tell us about cmm so yeah cmm basically uh, uh, it provides you the accurate dimensions means uh, the dimensions which are not uh, possible to measure manually it can be measured by computer generated uh, right. data coordinate measuring machine yes okay so you have that machine also in your company uh actually uh, we don't have a cmm sir we actually outsource those uh, jobs which are being done in cmms okay okay nice and once that uh, reverse engineering is done then what are the other activities you are doing once the design is confirmed on my end i uh, start drafting those uh, drawing i start drafting those on parts. the drawing yes yeah and uh, uh, those drawings are further uh, processed uh, to uh, means on based on those drawings uh, raw material is procured procured yeah and uh, later those drawings are uh, along with raw material are provided to operators uh, various operators so that uh, manufacturing process uh, starts process. okay yes. and then assembly will be done in your company only right right sir yes nice got it so tell us about mechanical design mastery course how uh, you find this course helpful major benefit of this course is uh, it is accessible anytime sir so whether it is uh, early morning late it be late night you can access anytime uh, as per your time management sir right and uh, uh, the main part means best part about this uh, md uh, means uh, mechanical uh, design mastery courses you can uh, watch in segments like particular topic you want to watch today and study upon that no uh, and uh, you can study up only that topic and uh, later you can continue from uh, other topics like okay it, as per it your convenience easy. yeah yes sir okay. and uh, it com- it completely covers your whole design uh, parts uh, starting from drawing uh, that is main basic part to uh, making uh, various models uh, projects sir. okay right fine fine and tell us something about our uh, six months course post graduate diploma in tool design how you find this course your opinion this course was a blessing in disguise sir for me it uh, it was like uh, uh to be honest uh, i was uh, i'll share my uh, experience for, uh, when i was in pune I, or before that i uh, uh, moved to pune uh, because i was uh, unable to uh, get any job in my uh, native place or uh, in my earlier place so i moved to pune later uh, i uh, i was finding it difficult to get jobs in the core design field so i got scammed also by various consultancies also oh. so i was kind of uh, down with uh, no uh, guidance proper guidance okay so um, slowly when i came in contact with your webinars and all i started writing those uh, points down 
means what were you what were you going to teach us and what will be covered so i uh, kind of researched upon this uh, topics and found it that these are the basic topics which the industry needs right now so uh, i was uh, i uh, means i was uh, con- i confirmed that this course would uh, you uh, help me in a long run sir so and i i have now i have no regrets at all sir this have course has helped me uh, like build my basic uh, knowledge sir thank you thank you so much and uh, those who want to start their journey as a design engineer what is your advice to new students because see many people they find that this design field means it's a research work but that is not true so what is your suggestion what new students they should do to achieve this success like you uh, to the new aspirants i want to uh, just say that you just start somewhere let it be just a small work let it be a small model you are doing the design part and uh, just get uh, motivating from that part i usually see uh, many uh, many mem- means mem- many of my members on linkedin they uh, either they do small work or uh, big work they get appreciated for their work a lot means uh, there is a lot of requirement for uh, design engineers and uh, the uh, skill design engineer so you start somewhere and uh, keep practicing uh, and keep the hard work and uh, you will achieve your dreams soon nice nice so this is very important part that means this will be encouraging as many students they have a fear about design so piyush i appreciate your efforts and uh, you have achieved this success so i wish you all the best for your future endeavors and there is one more level when you achieve 1 lakh per month in the job i will be again going for a second interview so i uh, i am waiting for that and uh, those who are watching this video if you want to start your journey as a design engineer uh, below link is given uh, join my free webinar and you will understand how to achieve this uh, design journey so thank you piyush thank you very much uh, yes, for sir. your time and wish you all the best thank you sir